Guys, today I've got Basilisk Blood for a drink. How Many Mother Season 1, Episode 16, by the way. But yeah, I got this. You know those, like... They're definitely fronts for some sort of criminal activity. But those, like, stores in the UK where they sell American sweets. And it's like, okay, it's like Lay's Crisps and that's about it. Um, or they had Basilisk Blood. So I thought we'd uh, crack it open and see how it is. Cost about £50. Had to take out a loan to get it um i'm gonna go with it probably just tastes like cranberry juice but we'll see maybe it actually is just basilisk blood as well that'd be kind of mad not cranberry juice it's like flat coke no no that's a bit insulting actually it's not that bad uh what is it like It's not bad. It's actually quite nice. For 50 quid? Maybe not, but that's not too bad. Anyway, how many mother episode 16? Let's go. Here's a professional tip. If it's still runny, it's not a cupcake. Ooh. It's a beverage. Yeah, well, things with Victoria Tate. are fun and easy and uncomplicated. It was pretty great. This is horrible. And he's going to be like, until. <laughs> All right, well. Um, are you coloring in your butt? I have a big interview coming up, and my suit has holes in it. That's your suit? Look, my only other suit options are track or birthday. <laughs> you need to borrow off Barney. Tomorrow, oh, and I should mention this is going to rock your world. Tomorrow, I'm taking you to my personal tailor. Hell yeah. A tailor, Barney. A Barney and Marshall app. And there is no way you're getting married in that, sarcastic quotation marks, suit. Tomorrow... New. Unacceptable for Barney. No thanks, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Noon? Noon. Okay. See yeah. you then. Hey, I'm on my way to meet Ted. It's our two-month anniversary, so we're going out to <laughs> right, Well, that answers all the questions I didn't ask. Bloody hell! On, we bust on each other. We're just at that place in our strong friendship. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh. yeah. Get off me. Yes, yes. The strong place in their friendship. Victoria's nice. Be nice back. If you want, I could take you shopping, maybe get you a discount. Really? That'd be great. Yeah. Huh. No offense, Robin, but Ted has far more chemistry with Victoria than he has with you. <laughs> I thought it was going to be just us tomorrow. What's with inviting Punky Brewster? Oh my god, here we go. Get over this Ted and Victoria thing. You had your chance and now he's moved on. <laughs> Can't you <laughs> just right. be happy for them? The best I can give you is a fake smile and dead eyes. Sold. Right. Victoria, what's wrong? Ted I just died. Been offered a fellowship at a culinary institute. Fellowship? In Germany. Oh, in Wait, Germany. Germany, Europe? It's for two years. Well, that's that then, isn't it? I'm waiting for her to just leave him like a random app. It's going to happen. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to go. Mm -hmm. And if you do, what does that mean for us? I don't know. Oh my god, are we doing this already? Couldn't you have given them half a season or something? Either you stay here, or we break up. Or you go to Germany. Wow. Um, <laughs> look, let's just see how things progress. And if by Imagine. September we still feel... I have to leave on Monday. Ah. Monday, September the... Dead. Next, so that, this is their final episode then. That lasts so long. Some time to think about what we want. We'll meet up tomorrow to discuss it. Well, it's easy for you. You're, you don't have to really do anything. It's either... She has to make the choice. Hey, baby, how's the dress place? Well, everything's... Well, Lily looks great, so there's your answer. Why is that? Illegal. Is he sweet? It's like shopping bag? in Barney's mind. <laughs> well, dog food? Oh, good luck, baby. Bye. Cat food. Hey, Barney? What is this? I'm not sure about this. Uh... Ted, Sergei says stop moping around. You're distracting him from his process. <laughs> you speak Ukrainian? Eh. <laughs> Guys. <laughs> Why and how? And long distance definitely isn't an option. No, 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 no. No way. You know who likes long distance? Oh, Girls. It's all yeah. talking and no sex. Kill me now. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I went for the high five for that one. You stay away from Lily. Or I swear to God, I'll eat that mustache right off of your ugly French face. Yeah. No, wow. Really oh, okay. I think he was crying. I never told Lily about it. To be honest, I'm not very proud of it. <laughs> to be even more honest, I am. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we flip flopped so much there. The point is that even though Lily is my soulmate, long distance still almost killed us. 
If you think that there's any chance that Victoria is your soulmate, you should ask her to stay. Um, no. Yeah, two months, you don't have that right. <laughs> Look, uh, she can't be a cat person. I'm a dog person. I'm attracted to other dog people. Are you sure? There we go, she's going to be a cat person instantly. Hello. Wow, that was a quick answer. About cats. Cats. Hated the musical, loved the animal. <laughs> Good to know. Um, okay. Goodbye. Well, she said she preferred them to dogs. She's a cat person. Well, no, not really. I like cats. Cats are cool, but they ain't beating dogs at any point. Oh, excellent. We'll take this yes. one. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, it's my suit. Shouldn't I be the one to choose? <laughs> Here, play with this pin cushion. <laughs> <laughs> Silly question. Ooh. Come on, dude. Three months working with me will make more than Lily makes in a year. That's pretty tempting. No, I made my decision. So have I. If I ask this girl to give up her dreams for me and two weeks later it's not working out, I'm like the biggest jerk of all time. It's just yes. too much pressure on a new relationship. Correct. I'm gonna tell her to go. He won't, Willie. Hardcore to her being like, stay. Thinking a lot about this. Okay, wait, uh, before you say anything, I wanted to give you this. Oh, it's a this break of cupcake. You know, let them finish baking. <sighs> Did you enjoy that? It was very nice. I'm going to Germany. That's how this conversation's going. I want you to stay. Okay. Oh, Ted. Oh, Teddyus. Everything here is dark. Oh, and we're going to get. Sketchy. And We're seems get, illegal. Um, it's like shopping in Barney's mind. Point of view. Oh, good luck, baby. Bye. Now, what sort of dress did you have in mind? Helen Mirren! No? I saw a couple up front that were nice. By the window? Mm. No offense, dear, but those are a little out of your price range. Oh, The stub? Gloria, have you decided what to do about your donut fellowship? <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, I want to go, but I don't want to lose Ted. Robin's being sly. All talking and no sex kill me now. <laughs> I know it sounds lame. Yes, Lily. But I actually think that Ted might be the one. Oh, get dunked on Robin. I'd feel a little step for turning down a huge opportunity to chase some guy I'd only known two months. Oh, sly! This is Ted! He's amazing. He's uh, it's fine. Uh, in America, but German guys, woo, I would let them bread my schnitzel any day if you know what I mean. Okay, well. I really don't. Sex. I don't... <laughs> Fair enough. Oh. oh. <laughs> like she's from Peter Pan or something. I've never seen a wedding dress like that to be fair. I'm sure it looks horrible if it's not on Lily. Gabrielle, and she's kind of. Homely and strange looking, and she was really self conscious about this little mustache she had. Yeah. Anyway, halfway through the semester, she just stopped <laughs> talking to me. I never figured out why. Uh, Marshall. Had your soulmate, then it may be worth it to hang on to him. Two years, though. Oh, for soulmates, it's too soon. Ooh, speak of the devil. Ah, uh, the cat conversation. Question How do you feel about cats? Cats hated the musical Love the Animal. A cat person? Why am I not sp No, wait for it. There'll be more. I did hear barking in the background. Maybe he's in a pet store. Was Does he want us to get a cat together? Maybe he's using an adorable kitty to guilt you into staying. You know, Robin's a psycho, you know. Do you really think that's what he's doing? Oh, I wouldn't even wait to find out. I would be on the next plane to Germany. Bro! Oh, oh God, you guys are suck. How did I prefer the other one, actually? Yeah. One of those front window dresses, just for fun. Hi. Are you okay? No, she's being a knob. I know you're not Victoria's biggest fan, but she seems to make Ted happy. That's the third time Lily's tried to make a point. In a good way, I'm, I'm agreeing with her. It's perfect. Oh, is this it? dress is totally going to get me laid on my wedding night. <laughs> We'll, wait, we'll, see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Now I'm actually thinking about it. I feel guilty. Like it's unfeminist or something. Oh, Robin. I know what you mean. You do? There she goes. She's going to take Lily's advice. Like choosing Ted over your career doesn't make you unfeminist. Maybe it just means that you guys would be happy together. Oh, uh, there we go. I think that you are the coolest. <laughs> I'm so glad that we're friends. Lily's oh no way, over you there. were the coolest. No, no, you are. <laughs> okay, I am. <laughs> You're not. You're third coolest in the room, so. <laughs> oh. 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 
Yeah, sure. I'm so beautiful. Oh, don't tell me how much it costs. Just snap my neck now so I can die this pretty. <laughs> but on a scale of never to never ever. Never ever ever uh, ever uh, ever. Uh, ever uh, okay. Times infinity. Ah. <laughs> Take our loan. What makes a bride beautiful is that she's just happy to be oh. getting there. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh guys, I know. <laughs> I look amazing. But the important thing is that Marshall and Oh, why did I go through me? I bet someone's actually done that as well. And the cake. <gasps> oh. But you know what? It's gonna come out because it's only chocolate and raspberry. Only, yes. <laughs> come on, get up, let us see how bad it is. <laughs> oh. Okay, well, run. <laughs> Someone in the audience was dying there. Just like this when I found it. And how will you be paying for this? Credit card. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> no, 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 no. I want you to stay. And is that that moment you realize? Okay. We're spiraling. <laughs> it's like. They keep changing their minds. I mean, I, I actually came here tonight leaning towards staying, but when you just told me to stay, it made me realize that I have to go. So what is it, opposite day or something? Go? Yeah. No. So it is. <laughs> Dad, we've only been dating for two months. I can't let you make this decision for me. You really shouldn't. But then you gave me this cupcake and it reminded me how great you are. Well, is there any chance that you would move to Germany with me? Well, that's just crazy. Don't be silly. Okay. So it's fine for me to make sacrifices for you, but for you, it's crazy. But it's Rachel and Ross. You have nothing there. You'd have me. We've only been dating two months. Well, and she does have stuff in Germany. What? It's not fair. It's it's not fair that we have to break up. I hate this. Oh, no. Rats. My job that I talk about all the time. We're breaking up. I guess so. <laughs> go to Germany, bro. No, I guess so. Probably the last place on the list I'd ever want to go to, but... God, that sucks, man. So sorry. <laughs> just too much. Hell yeah, my boy. He does look good though. Think... Yes, Marshall, I see your new suit and it's awesome. Well, thank you for acknowledging it. It's weird that you hadn't. Look, <laughs> she's leaving tomorrow. Yeah, but she's still in town. Yeah, she. But, but... She's still in town. Yeah. So you spend one more amazing day together. To be fair, you are only meant to have one night together. So, bonus days. Do you sit on the couch and cry about it, or would you run? and jump and do some awesome air kicks while you still could. <laughs> Got him. Awesome air kicks, huh? New pajama bottoms? You know it. <laughs> Hell yeah. Cry, or we can run and do awesome air kicks before our leg gets chopped off. Wait, so we're sharing the leg? And no, the leg is a metaphor. <laughs> I don't want it to leave. Three apps feels too little. Yeah, it's still so sick it needs to be chopped off the next. <laughs> No, they have chemistry. This is so annoying. Let's do all the stuff we talked about doing and never got around to. Like go to the Mets? Yeah, we'll walk across the Brooklyn Bridge. See some monkeys at this. Never got around to. It's been two months. Oh my god. And kids, that's exactly what we did with our last day. Yeah. The museum. Looks like it. The bridge. <laughs> the restaurant. What a great day. I'm just gonna wait for the next time Marshall really screws up, and then I'll just slip this in, and then it won't seem so bad by comparison. Well, here's hoping he cheats. Healthy. <laughs> But only like second base. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look at us. Oh, look at Two him. Two guys in suits. Hey, babe. Dollar beer night, so I splurged and got us each our own. <laughs> so, have you thought what I'd a treat. About to work? Sergey sent me your bill. Come on. Bernie, this says $4,000. Oh, I thought you well, said that, that it was one sense. third price. Yeah, must be a $12,000 suit. Oh, well, guess you'll have to come work at my company. Do it. You set this up. You set this whole thing up. I most certainly did. I believe it. Baby, I, I know that this will make things harder, but I will make it work. I promise. I destroyed an $8,000 wedding dress. He cried. What time is the interview? <laughs> 9 a.m. And you'll need new shoes. Uh, Don't worry. I know a guy. Uh, the tall grand in debt. That's not too bad. I'm glad we got to spend the day doing an awesome air kick. She's actually leaving. This is the worst. Maybe she run. She might run off the plane. We've seen that happen before. Oh, two years. So in season four. Hey, you know, three, I mean, if, three, four, if we get back, back, she might come back. Still single. We can. Even if we're not. <laughs> 
she'll come back. The, I don't think this will be the last we'll see of Victoria. This doesn't feel like one of those romances where they're just gone. Like, this is done. Maybe they did this episode. Okay, I know it never oh, works wait, for anyone, wait. but do you want to try long distance? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. okay. <laughs> The last minute. We can beat the odds. Oh, schmads. <laughs> it's gonna work. We're gonna make it work. It'll work. It didn't work. <laughs> Long distance was and is a terrible idea. Oh, never mind. Why well, is that kind of heartbreaking? But more on that Ordered. later. More on that later. See, oh, they get me invested in these stories. I'm not gonna lie. As each episode goes by, I get more and more invested. <laughs> um. Another really great episode. We're on, a, we're on a roll, to be fair. We've had banger after banger after banger. So I feel like the Victoria romance, because they do... I, I feel like Victoria and Ted do actually have genuinely good ro um, chemistry. That I feel like we've kind of parted from this, you know, swooning over Robin thing, which was getting a bit much, especially for how early on in the show we are, and just had him get with someone who he actually has good chemistry with. So Ted is kind of on a roll a bit as well and then like Marshall and Barney were great this episode Lily was great Robin was a bit annoying but she kind of came around at the end like after she listened to Lily's words of wisdom uh so overall a pretty great episode with some good jokes in there but I think it's like the dynamics between the episode uh, between the characters that are really starting to work for me like they were pretty good anyway but I feel like they're starting to get into great territory where the, the kind of five characters are bouncing off each other really really well um so I'm feeling another eight after let me think, let me think. Lily was good, sitting in the cake. Marshall and Barney were very good. We haven't really seen Marshall and Barney have an episode together, so it was good to kind of have that, like, without Ted. And then Ted and Victoria. Yeah, I'll go an 8 out of 10. There wasn't really a bad storyline, to be honest. So there we go, guys. I think we've had quite a few 8 out of 10s. Let me just check. I'll, I'll check later. But I think it's I think it's like four in a row or something. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know if you thought of the episode down below in the comments. I'm going to finish my Basilisk Blood. We got about halfway through it with that episode, so... Wish me luck. Maybe I'll die. Maybe I won't. And I'll see you next time for episode 17. Until then, take care. Peace.